what's up YouTubers, Lee John Blackmore here, you, a super easy guitar. I <laughs> uh, hope you guys are good, thank you very much for your support, I super super appreciate it and I love all the letters and requests you've been sending me, I say letters, I mean emails, I'm so old school. Um, yeah, you can find me on Instagram, don't forget, if you want to send me any uh, requests or just any messages, I've had messages from all over the world which is amazing, I try and respond to all of them. Um, you know, fire them over to Facebook, you can find the link below, or fire them over to me on Instagram, whatever, okay guys, I'd love to hear from you. So, um, I've kind of made a basic version of The Unforgiven. Now, you know, there's tons and tons of versions online. As usual, I want to keep this super simple, so just nice easy chords, and there's a few little fiddly bits you can mess around with, but if you just want to play the song and sing it, um, this is the video for you, so let's zoom in and get straight into it. Okay, so let's have a look. What I'm doing, I'm playing basically an A minor chord, alright? And to start off with, remove your first finger and pluck, if you can do this with a pick, even better. If not, don't worry too much. So I'm holding the pick as normal and I've got my uh, birdie finger ready on the go, okay, my second finger. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to put that on the B string, the second string, and I'm going to pluck the A string with my pick, my guitar pick. So, so you get that kind of, you're hitting two strings at the same time. Now, if you watch James Hetfield live with his acoustic guitar, that's what he does, okay? So, uh, these are pretty close to the chords he's playing, but they're not exact, all right, guys? It's just to put you in the, uh, in the realm to get this song down. So, pluck in the second string and the fifth string at the same time. Then third string, fourth string. And then I'm going second, third, fourth. happens twice, okay? Slowly. Okay. And then I'll put my first finger down to finish that A minor, okay? It's actually an A sus2 with a finger off. Put the finger back down, normal A minor, then Then I'm just going 2nd string, 3rd string, 4th string. Put it together, take that finger off. Put it on. And then start again, double pluck. So sometimes I miss it as well, don't worry, you'll do the same. Off. Okay, off, on, off, on, off, and so on, okay? Whenever you're learning something like this though guys, don't worry about the speed. The speed comes later on. Get the technique down first, then work on the speed, okay? So then I'm going to stay on this A minor. And we're going to do something like that, okay? So again, back to this sus2, bringing the first finger off, A sus2. So I'm going from the fifth string down to the second. Then I'm putting my first finger down, plucking that second string. Then the same on the B string. Then I'm plucking back on the G. Okay, so slowly. Finger down, pluck it again on the B, remove it, then hit the G. So that 
that's the first one, okay? The second one... So it starts the same, except you don't take the finger off then, and you go B, G, okay? The second finger, sorry, second string, third string. So both of them together slowly. Okay, and that repeats a couple of times. So then I'm going to C with that double pluck again. The same strings at the beginning, the fifth and the second. So I'm going... See my fingers off. Then I'm forming a C, double pluck. And then I'm just doing G, Sorry, D, G, B. C chord. Don't have to be perfectly accurate as long as you've got the chord. Then I'm taking my first finger Okay, and I'm pulling it off, so that's the first fret on the second string. I'm pulling off to open, and then I'm going to a G. And I'm not worried about playing this top E, so it's super slow. third finger over okay and then I'm going from on the G string the second fret slide into the fourth then playing an A minor okay so again slow Second time round, get rid of the first finger, I'm still playing like this A minor shape. Straight to a C. Then hit the top E. Put the pinky on the B string on the third fret. And then hit the open B. So let's do that. Major. Then he's got this. So that's just um, the second fret on the G string. I'm hammering down with the third finger into the fourth fret. Then I'm pulling off back to it. So I'm hammering on fourth, pulling off back to two. Then pulling off my first finger to have an open G. Then at the end of that, I'm playing the two note again, the second fret note again. Super slow. Okay, super slow. Or well, you can pluck that last one. probably does that okay so the last one is your third finger on the chord slowly okay from the top now 
let's do the change to C. again he does plug that not open and then E major so I missed that note last time ends on the fourth fret and then sorry So it's, you know, to play, it's, I'm not used to playing stuff like slow, you know, I'm full of excuses as usual, but um, play it slow guys, excuse me. Okay, so let's have a look at the chords if you want to sing along. So it starts off with A minor. New blood joins this earth, E minor, and quickly D, he's subdued, A minor, through constant e, uh, A minor, Disgraced E minor, D, the young boy learns there, A minor rules, starts again, with time the child draws in, so that's A minor, E minor, this whipping boy done wrong, so that's D, A minor, A minor again, deprived of all his thoughts, E minor, the young man D struggles on and on. So that bit slightly changes. On and on he knows. So I'm doing there A minor. I'm taking my second finger, moving it over one string to the second fret on the fifth string. And that plays B. And then it goes C. And then slide that the third finger on the third fret on the A string five okay so the young man struggles on and on he knows oh sorry so the young man struggles on and on he's known a vow unto his own so that C unto his G that never from this day D and A minor his will they'll take away yeah so c take away g resolve on the e now we're into the chorus what i felt what i've known never shine into what i've shown never be never see and I won't, won't see what might have been What I felt, what I know Never shine into what I show Never free, never me So I dub the unforgiven oh, oh. So I dub the unforgiven So the chorus is A minor, what I felt, C, what I've known, G, never E minor, 
to what I've shown A minor Never B C Never C G That's not confusing is it? Um, won't see what my have been Which is I think that should be an E major there It's written on here as an A minor uh, E minor sorry uh, and then it goes back again, A minor. What I felt, C. What I've known, G. Never shine into what I've shown. That's E minor, A minor. Never free, which is C. Never me, which is G. And here it resolves, E major. So I dub the unforgiven, A minor, C, G. And again, E dub the unforgiven, A minor, C, G. So I dub the unforgiven. So there you have it guys, hope you enjoyed this week's lesson. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. Hit the bell button, you'll get updates every week on these lessons. Uh, don't forget you can find me on Instagram, Facebook, love to hear from you guys, alright? Uh, tune in the same time next week, okay? Enjoy!